Hi guys. In this lecture, we'll see what is tooltip and how we can design a tooltip in our systems. But before that, let's see what is tooltip. So this is the bootstrap and uh, I have just opened the document about the tooltip. This is the tooltip. If we hover on a text and it, it gives a description or descriptive text above or um, above or below the text, that is called tooltip in a in a form of pop pop over right if we have to design the tooltip in html generally we design like this so we we just provide the database tooltip and we just uh, uh, provide the title so this title generally uh, converts in a form of tooltip and out th this uh, css and bootstrap handle it very um, intelligently and just show us uh, in a form of tooltip, we can de define the uh, placement by using this particular attribute. This is the HTML implementation, but we'll see how we can implement the same thing in our system. So let's have a look. So let me add a new screen. I have deleted the previous uh, screen. I will just give the name jet and will include in the menu. So I will have the widget enter menu. This example is for tooltip, so I will just uh, provide a proper title. So we have a tooltip widget available. This is the tooltip widget. We can use this tooltip to show the tooltip, right? So let me just drag and drop. If you just um, follow the tooltip in the widget tree, you will have you 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 will come to know how we can use that. So this is the tooltip widget. Under that, we have two placeholder one is content and one is tooltip under content we'll put the content what needs to be shown on ui and under tooltip we'll uh, put the description or the text what needs to be shown under the tooltip so let me just show the content i will just add one text and this is tooltip content okay now under tooltip, I will add another text and I will say this is the description of uh, tooltip text in a form of tooltip. Okay, we have a so we have just given the descriptive text under tooltip. If you see the property of tooltip, first we have the source block, second the position where we need to show bottom left bottom right bottom center right you can see the behavior here in the ui as well how it will look like start open so let's see i don't i also don't know what it is i have never used set to two to show the tooltip when the page is first loaded without the need for the initial trigger yes if false the tooltip is not visible ideally we gen we generally don't uh, put this through because we don't want to show tooltip until and unless user hover to the content right trigger set how the tooltip is triggered by default the tooltip shown on hover yes it should be shown on hover only but we can trigger on click as well and uh, we can write our custom trigger as well extended class if we need to uh, um, add any extra css class we can add similarly we can handle the on initialize event and on toggle event as well we can handle so when tooltip will be shown it will automatically called when tooltip will be hide it will automatically called so we can if you want to perform some specific action in that particular case we can just handle that event i generally never encountered in a scenario where i i have used this so i believe it is very rare when we have to handle this this events so let me just publish and show you how it will look like on the ui perfect let me open that. Uh, I have done something wrong. So let me open the open the screen directly. Let's wait. Perfect. So this is my tooltip. If I hover, you see the tooltip uh, at the bottom of this content. We can set the um, direction as well, right? Where we need to show the tooltip. It can be top, it can be left, it can be right, it can be bottom left, bottom right, top left, top right that's it this is how we can just show the tooltip that's it for this lecture guys